This is cool because if you want to take down a celebrity, just look where the money is coming from. But you're going to see this with Crypto.com and that Matt Damon is a little bit different, right? If you're on social media, on Twitter specifically, I think you're going to see a lot of buzz with Matt Damon and Crypto.com right now. So here's what's really happening. Um, a couple of days ago on March 27, this was this uh, event in L.A., about this movie Air, where Matt Damon and other people participate, right? And somebody asked him to Matt Damon about his, you know, involvement with Crypto.com ad back in 2021. And obviously, celebrities, when it comes to a partnership with companies, it's it's you know what's going on. But especially because crypto companies right now, some of them like FTX, uh, have that really bad reputation. Tom Brady and other ones, uh, all most of their fame now in jeopardy because hey come on you told me to get involved with ftx and i lost everything so you're a clown right but what happened here is that matt damon was doing this for his charity water.org and he said at the end of the day you know and he's that really grateful with crypto.com that they wanted to pitch in a million dollars for that and you know that's the reason why he did that commercial fortune favors the brave but there's another side to this if you take a look at the price Right kind of after he made that commercial, the price skyrocketed for Crow all the way to 99 cents. I'm going to show you everything right now. Then, of course, we're seeing at 6, 7 right now. So, obviously, I think a lot of people want to hold celebrities accountable, especially with their involvement with a cryptocurrency or any type of business. But this is cool. Let me tell you everything. Go ahead and smash the like button, everybody. Consider subscribing to the channel. Here's the video March 27, a couple days ago in L.A., um, you know, everyone has their own opinion on this and their angle. Uh, I don't really care if you are involved in a crypto exchange. I mean, I'm sure that you want to make money, whatever. But I think it was really cool to see the, the video because I think it's a great representation of the brand of crypto.com, FFTB. Perfect. But here it is, right? Um, on October 28, it was launched 2021. Like it's starting the uh, kind of like the bull uh, season. Like it was pretty nice up there and you take a look at this one october 2021 right before we were launching all the way to a dollar right now we're back here in the price i mean you could have said hey come on before that uh, opportunity completely blasted off all the way to the moon i think it was nice timing if you were picking up on this one obviously became really popular a lot of controversy as well and backlash kind of pa participating with an exchange that it wasn't coinbase or whatever other exchange right but right now the greed and the prices that we're seeing yesterday twenty nine thousand bitcoin obviously kind of asking ourselves well is this really the comeback and are we going to see more celebrities doing this for crypto companies I don't think so for the near few, for the short term, right? Because I don't think they want to get involved um, with the risk that we're seeing right now. And it does seem that Matt Damon did this commercial not for his own benefit, just to help his his charity. That's it. And that was cool. I think a lot of people, the comments I'm seeing there, they're like, "That's cool. That's cool." I think finally a clear response to that involvement. Obviously, it doesn't really affect the price of crypto.com right now, what he says, but during the bull market, it was a nice marketing campaign launch to get a lot of people, to get a lot of eyeballs with someone that was recognized in the United States to say, man, that's cool. And well, <laughs> if we go back to the one week, that time, I guess I love to see it here. That time was roughly about here. 20 cents or so so we're right here now and it's been forever and these levels we are going to be approaching as we continue doing what we know best for participating in staking holding crypto.com and the rest this was cool guys i'm seeing a lot of buzz and of course wanted to share with you the news absolutely i think um the more celebrities or the more endorsements crypto.com has i think it's quite better but it have to be really nice strategized. Not whoever wants, I think Chris wants to, you know, get associated with the brand. And on another note, I think eventually, guys, crypto.com is going to do really well when it comes to organic growth. The need of celebrity is not really the end. It's not really the keyword, especially in a bear market. But you could imagine now that we have LeBron James, right, participating with the brand, 
those are those cool endorsements as later on we can use them as a bull market rises. There's still some opportunities and hey, if there's anything, if this Matt Damon de deal was any indicator that we could do much better with other different people as well in a particular bull market case, I'm sure that plus $1 with this one helping with the pump, that will be a nice way to reach the levels that we want to see. Now that we know this, obviously, I think we can be able to profit really well on those days to come. I'll see you next time, everybody. Like and subscribe. It's pretty cool. Peace.